This is not an anti-car measure. It's about making uh, travel more effective and more pleasant for everybody at all times. And transportation planners say pleasant comes at a price. They're considering charging you to drive on busy streets or go in and out of downtown during rush hour. The pricing would work like this. If you travel during the peak rush hour of 8 to 8.30, you'd get charged the most money. Outside of that time, if you drive between 7 and 9, you'd still get charged a little bit. Or if you drive at another time, you won't get charged anything at all. The message, if you have a flexible schedule, flex it. When you do surveys, not everybody has such a rigid schedule that they have to be on the road at that time. Planners say more than a quarter of the traffic delays in the Bay Area happen right here, south of Market, as people get on and off the freeway. They say if you have to commute during rush hour, maybe a toll will make you take the bus. Congestion costs San Francisco $2.3 billion a year in lost time and business because people can't get from here to there. They can't access uh, retail opportunities and they can't get to their job. So planners are looking at two options. The first would charge you to drive on major roads like Van Ness Avenue. The idea being that it might motivate you to take the side streets instead and balance out the traffic load. The second plan would actually draw a ring around downtown and charge people to go in or out. People who live downtown might be exempt. We're talking about tolls in the neighborhood of a buck fifty collected automatically and the money would go to better roads and buses. It doesn't go into hospitals, it doesn't go into education, it goes right back into providing the commuter that paid that fee a better commute. So what do folks think of this? Cron4's Dan Kerman has reaction. 